Hey everyone, what's up? My name is Chris from whoschrishughes.com and in this video I'm going to teach you how to create the Facebook profile banner uh, cover here. And as you'll see here, I just created this, just learned how to do it, figured I'd teach you as well. Uh, this is for anyone who's on a Mac computer. Uh, I have a MacBook Pro so I'm going to do this and show you exactly how to do it with a free program called Paintbrush. And uh, there's going to be links below this video to download Paintbrush if you need it. But let's get right into it. So as, start, as soon as you start up, what you want to do is click on Open Paintbrush. And up at the top here, you're going to go to File and click New. And what's going to happen is this little box is going to pop up on the screen here. And the dimensions for the profile cover is... 849 by 313 so all you gotta do is click that and click OK and I usually like to drag this out a little bit so you have more room to play around with on the edges I'm not a great graphic designer so I'm just gonna show you how I created uh, the one that I did here with me as a little baby a little older and you know just a little joke one but so all I want you to do here is if you have some certain pictures that you want to include in here uh, on the Mac, I have, it's just every time you open up a picture file, it opens it up in the preview setting. And it's just a little program that opens up pictures. And the easiest way to do this is if you just click inside the picture, uh, anywhere outside of it, it highlights whatever's inside. If you hit Command C, it's going to copy it. And you go back into Paintbrush and you can just Command V, that'll paint that picture in here and you know you do the same thing with the other pictures so I'm going to do this here command C paint that we'll just place that there and with the one in the middle here okay so we did that and then now you can go to the little T here is for text uh, and then a little box will pop up. You'll see here I clicked T and then the little arrow here on the screen pops up. You just click and I'm going to type that out. And if you hit Command A, it's going to highlight this. And the font box is going to pop up and you can change the font. And I'm just going to go with handwriting. I'll make it a little bigger so you can see it. And then all you got to do is hit place. And we'll have that there. And We'll do another font thing here. This time we'll use size 14 or size 18 font. And we'll put Sir Catchy quote here. And we'll just hit place. And all you gotta do is click on the screen and that'll drop that picture there. Uh, there's a lot of better tutorials on YouTube here that are gonna teach you how to use paint, you know, if you're more in more in depth. Uh, videos on doing things like that but this is just a preview just gonna teach you how it's done uh, now I'm also gonna include below this video on my blog uh, a little image here that looks like that looks like this here and you'll see here so if you want you can use that image to kind of place a little avatar thing here and I'll show you some creative ones just to kind of get your brain moving and give resources below this post on my blog. Okay, so on the social media examiner link below this video on my blog, uh, you're going to be able to go through and you can see some creative uses like here with Tim Ware. I got Mark Zuckerberg, it's not very creative. Kelly Cromwell, uh, let's see, some cool ones right here. E.T. Uh, this is cool, looks like somebody's shooting lasers. Uh, but these are just things that you possibly can do. You're going to have to get really creative. I personally am not good at that, so I'd hire someone. If you want to just hire someone, I'm going to include a link below on my blog that you know you can click on and find out you know where you can hire someone to do that. So that's it. I hope this video helps, and if you have any questions, leave them below. I'll see you soon.